Mr. Shashank, hearty congratulations on securing All India Rank 6, Gate 2023, Civil Engineering Branch. Thank you so uh, very much. Thank yeah. you. Mr. Shashank, can you briefly use yourself? Uh, my name is Shashank Chikan Mishra. I have done completed. Uh, I have completed my bachelor's in uh, civil engineering from uh, Indian Institute of Technology, Bhubaneswar. So you are a graduate from. Am I uh, audible, sir? Yeah, you are audible. You are audible. Yes, sir. IIT Bhubaneswar. Yes, so you are IIT graduate from IIT Bhubaneswar. Very good. Yes, Very sir. Good. When did you graduate? Sir, I graduated in 2021. 21. 21. Right. Okay. Yes, so, uh, Shashank, uh, this all in rank is six. Uh, so, very good rank. Uh, can you tell us how many attempts you have taken to reach this all India rank six? Sir, if I, uh, if I count my serious attempt, it, it's my second attempt, seriously. Right. right. Serious, your attempt. second attempt. Right. Very good. Very yes, good, sir, uh, very good. So, which coaching program that you have availed from our ACE Engineering Academy? So, I have availed the online test series program of uh, ACE Academy right. in right. 2021, also 22 and 23. Good. So, you have availed uh, uh, what you call uh, three years consecutively of online, online test, test series. series. Right. Shashank, please tell yes, us. Yes, online test series, three years. Yeah. Shashank, please tell us how this ACE Academy online test, test series. Sir, uh, played a role in our success. Okay, sir. Sir, it was quite helpful in, uh, in, in enhancing my preparation because I have seen like all the three years when I've given the tests of ACE test series. So I found that the question, level of questions was uh, slightly uh, more than what we have in GATE. So it uh, provides a bit more better understanding of what is the level of examination. And if the questions in exam are slightly higher than what we are expecting in test series, then uh, it, it's easy for us to tackle those. Because if we solve the test series mostly up to the gate level or lower than that, then it won't be helpful. So in that scenario, AS test series was quite good for me. And also the platform which uh, the online test series of AS provides, like, uh, you can judge yourself on the basis of percentage of marks every time we are getting and we have that gross percentage and all. So it was quite helpful to judge my performances and compare it from the, with the previous tests and all. And also uh, I have seen that the, in the test series we are provided with the free tests for the last year, last year test series provided as free. So that also helps in uh, like uh, more number of tests are there for you to practice. So it's quite helpful in uh, 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 having trip, uh, Completing my preparation. Right. Good, Shisha. The, so good. in our full-length mock test, particularly in the month of January, February, first week, etc., where you used to stand rank-wise in the mock test series of yes. ACE Academy? So uh, as far as I remember, sir, mostly my uh, approximately marks were, what, whatever highest marks I got was around 74 to 75, and ranking was... Uh, if I am not sure, that around 20 to 30, maybe. Right. I'm not uh, exactly so sure. So for this uh, gate to all India sixth rank, how many marks you have got? What is your score now? So my score is 79.78. Marks, marks 17 point. Yes, sir. Yeah, marks, marks is 79.78. Yeah, marks. And score is, uh, if I'm not wrong, 983. Sorry? The, the gate score is 983. 983. Out good. of 1000. Right. Good, good. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Out of 1000, right. Uh, Shashank, see, in our civil engineering, there are so many subjects are there, right? Did you cover this yes, in all the subjects with equal emphasis? Otherwise, uh, any specific strategy that you have followed here? Sir, so, over the year, I have seen that uh, there are few subjects which are more important for as per the gate perspective. If we see like uh, we have uh, soil mechanics is there, environment is there, and uh, uh, like uh, structure and soam is there. So these uh, these subjects are. Be more specific on those subjects and the subjects which are having less uh, less uh, weightage. I I haven't neglected those subjects. I've tried to cover all of them because uh, you never know what comes in the exam. 
so our strategy should be set, like we have to cover all the things but we should make sure that uh, whatever time we are investing in that subject so we should have a that amount of returns from that because if you are investing too much time on the subjects like railways and airport then that is not helpful because we don't get too much marks from that so we need to judiciously divide that divide us time in the yes, for different that's what subjects. i'm telling you that's what i'm telling you right this railways and airports they're all uh, uh, what you call very less weightage is given there very less weight. On the other hand, yes, if you see the geotechnical engineering, environmental engineering, yes, right? sir. even strength of materials, uh, these are given yeah. very good weightage. So, but yes, you prepared all those with more or less equal emphasis, right? Yes, yeah, you have to prepare all that because uh, uh, if you want to succeed the exam in a bit better way, you can't neglect anything. Right. That's fine, uh, uh, Shashank. Shashank, on the day of uh, gate examination, in the three hours of time, uh, did you yes, follow sir. any specific strategy? Otherwise, I mean to ask you that, uh, uh, did you attempt the questions as per the order they appeared in the, on the screen? Otherwise, any specific uh, order that okay. you followed there? So, uh, actually, on the day of exam and also in, in the test series, also I followed one specific order that I tried to cover the two marks question and on first basis i tried to cover that because they take slightly much more time and they are more uh, like if we do them correctly they are more rewarding rather than doing one marks question because uh, sometimes it happens that uh, while doing one marks question we uh, spend more of time and that uh, and the two marks question at last are slightly easier if something is like that but if you, if you don't have time for that then that is lost so i tried to cover two marks question first and then go to the first one mark questions right good but i had many stoppers also they follow this type of strategy and one more thing shashank out of 100 marks you got a 79 point something marks there so where did you lose the other uh, other 20 yes, marks where did you lose so uh, some of the marks some of the marks I lost in MSQ questions because uh, they were slightly confusing this time because this time I think Gate has introduced much more theory portion rather than numericals. So I lost just some amount of marks there and few uh, silly mistakes in the numericals, which I would like, which would have, if I would have done that better, I would have scored around 85. So right. that right. made a problem. One more Shashanka. Uh, normally, the toppers in this gate and ESC examination, uh, apart from classroom uh, uh, coaching notes, etc., they also prepare a short notes also. In our case, did you prepare any, any such yes, short sir. notes? Mm -hmm. Yes, sir, for sure. Prepared. I prepare short notes for every subject. Yes, sir. So short because short that's uh, very important to revise. Yeah, okay, right. Now, how many pages for uh, each subject? On, uh, for example, see geotechnical engineering. Given highest weightage of about mm -hmm. 15 to 16 marks there. Environmental engineering, 13 marks yes, weightage sir. there. So for this uh, top two subjects, how many pages you have prepared the short notes? So uh, exactly, I don't remember the pages, but I think uh, I would have covered uh, soil mechanics full in around uh, 60, uh, 50 to 60 pages in a short uh, in short way. In a, My booklet was a small one, not that uh, big register. Okay, right, right. So I tried to cover in that much. Okay, okay, you can call it as a short note, otherwise, mini notes also, right? Yeah. But very, very handy yes. for you. Actually, so I, yeah. Actually, I think so. Short note should be uh, on the personal basis because everyone has some uh, things that yes. one remembers and one some uh, loses from the mind. So uh, you, you can make it accordingly what you want. Yeah, that's to, why that's why I want to ask you because this okay. is student specific. Yeah. Student specific. The yeah, short that's student mean. specific. Yeah. So in your yes, short sir. notes, what points you used to maintain there? So mostly, uh, I tried to maintain those specific points which were which can be asked like for, uh, as a direct question maybe, and some like assertion reasoning type questions are there and most and uh, for sure formulas all the formulas are there so uh, they should be we should go through them uh, uh, regularly because if we don't then it's a problem, and some theory portion which is uh, most more frequent in the exam, and more like more technical or analytical type which we might forget. At points, so I try to maintain in that way. Right. So, how often you used to revise these short notes, Mr. Shashan? So, if I uh, tell you about last two months in January and February first week, so uh, almost I tried to cover all the subjects uh, uh, in uh, in a duration of eight to ten days. 
each subject which should be revised at least uh, two to three times okay in a, in the month of january that was the uh, right. motto okay one more thing uh, what about this uh, importance of the previous year's question bank in our gate examination did you solve the previous year's questions yes sir i solved the previous year questions because they are quite important for you to gauge the level of the examination because if you don't follow, solve the previous year so you won't be able to get uh, what what the level of exam is there what type of questions they are trying, trying to ask because sometimes it happens like uh, and you just have to if you have gone through those questions then you have a clear idea of how you need to go for the question and what should be the right step so that helps a lot that is my, i think that is must for a student to pre uh, prepare for gate right sashank uh, in your successful story if i ask you to summarize uh, what do you say the what you call the summary of your success story so if i am asked to summarize i would say that one should have a belief on himself or herself that the person can do uh, whatever he wants to do and uh, one should work consistently if one is studying 3 to 4 maybe for even 3 hours a day he should study daily there shouldn't be a time like one day you are studying too much and uh, next to four days you are just relaxing so being consistent is the key because if you revise the things consistently then only they will be uh, stable in your mind and most importantly you have to have the confidence in yourself if you because if you don't believe in yourself then on the day of examination you will always be always be like feeling like uh, will i be able to do that or not and in that case you always try always commit mistakes so two things have so uh, so we need to consist be, be consistent and we need to have belief in ourselves good good and apart from this uh, mr sheshank uh, would you like to uh, give any more tips to this uh, aspirants of the gate examination particularly the civil engineering branch Any no more tips, tips for uh, these juniors not made need to i would like to say to students like uh, they should try to inculcate or imbibe whatever the uh, teachers are trying to tell them like uh, you should follow the cl class notes or booklets which ever you are reading in a proper manner and try to uh, finish the like whatever you have studied daily you should be uh, able to complete that on that day only and you need to solve the questions properly Pre uh, you should go for the previous years and then the booklet questions are there if you are pursuing any coaching or anything else whatever you are having so and uh, i would prefer that you should uh, going you, you should go through the question bank of gate at least two to three times because that helps you to likely sometimes memorize also what are the uh, correct ways to perform the question because if you go through uh, uh, solve the question in first attempt in a correct way then it also saves your time and my, you may you may get the correct result in the first time and so most important key is what i said that is consistently consistent you need to be consistent because if you don't do that then it's very difficult for a person to qualify any examination whatever it may be be it gate or anything is there so these are the things you, and you must follow your teachers because if, uh, whatever they are telling they are telling to the experience and definitely it will help you to succeed right good mr shashank how we are going to make you this all india sixth rank in this gate examination so most probably i would be applying for the psus which are which will be recruiting from grade 2023 so i would mm. like to get a job from this okay this right so any idea of preparing for the engineering service examination so for engineering services i am uh, i am currently preparing for that only means preparation is going on okay. so okay so this time so main preparation to is like you you need to solve the ample number of questions whatever you may you have the capacity yes. how much you can do like you can solve the previous year or and you can go for the previous year questions of the civil services examination ifs is there too much questions are available yes. how much you can solve it on yourself and booklet questions also the conventional one and yeah, so the prelims it's are less. yeah need a lot of practice because uh, uh whatever i think sir one can go and solve only those questions in the examination which one has practiced for because examination pressure is very high uh, it's very difficult for a person to uh, think differently or think on a new question there sitting there and there because time is also a constraint and you need to be accurate too so uh, as much as you can practice that is the best
right so that only okay. i am working on right yeah shashank very good once again i please convey our best wishes to your parents and other friends right who are very supportive sure, to sir. you right we once again yes, congratulate you. you on securing such all india sixth rank god bless you wish okay. you all good luck in all your future Thanks, attempts right thank you sir thank you thank you much. thank you shashank thank you sir